Hi, this is Peter Nash from the Adobe Experience Manager podcast here at Access 41. I had a chance to attend the Adobe Summit 2013 conference recently where they announced the new Adobe Experience Manager. Um, the, uh, uh, you know, it's essentially just a rebrand uh, of CQ. You know, now the latest version is going to be 5.6. Um, they've made some strides to you know bring their entire suite of products under one roof as the Adobe Marketing Cloud. Uh, it was the big announcement there at the conference. I wanted to take a minute to explain some differences in the new environment that might feel weird if you have used a previous version of CQ. So let's just log in and take a look. Uh, I am running just a, a local version of the base install, so I'm going to put in admin, admin. As you can see, this is much different from the screen that you're used to seeing. One of the things that Adobe wanted to do was make the system much friendlier for tablet or touch devices. It's unlikely that you're going to want to do the majority of your development and authoring work through such a device, but now uh, you at least have the option. Uh, and I must say that the, the interface is pretty usable from uh, one of those devices. I, I had a chance to kind of play around with it, and it was, it was functional. One of my first questions, though, was where are all the controls I used to have after I logged in? How do I find CRXDE Lite? Where's my site admin panel, uh, etc.? cetera? Uh, essentially, my, my problem was this isn't the same as I'm used to using. Thankfully, they you know didn't get rid of all of those things. Um, if I select the Tools tab here at the bottom left, you will see um, those things uh, that you're used to. So, you know, here is CRXDE Lite. Uh, here is your tag management, um, you know, as well as all of the, you know, the other options that you're used to, to using. But if you are like me and you have to be dragged kicking and screaming when things change, uh, don't worry. Uh, if I take my mouse and I put it here on the tab I have selected, you'll see an icon of a computer monitor uh, on the right side of the tab. This icon shows up for all of the tabs you see listed uh, when you actually have them selected. But if we click on the icon, you can see it opens up a new tab in my browser to show us the old CQ list of admin options. Uh, so here is CRXDE Lite. Here is um, where I do replication, here's where I get to see our, our cloud services, etc. Um, as I mentioned, this works for all of those tabs we had listed on the left. So if we jump back to our initial tab in the browser, um, I'm going to select Sites. And now I'm going to click on the computer monitor icon. Again, we have a new tab open up and we can see the site admin that I'm used to. As far as I've noticed, uh, all the features have the same basic controls that they used to in, in CQ 5.5. Uh, we'll continue to feature other things as well as changes uh, that you know we come across as we continue to play around in the new system.